What is going on, everybody? You guys finally did it, so it's here. The uh, bundle opening in what a time it was. They finally dropped. If you've been living under a rock, um, I know I'm going to be a couple days late, but here it is. Uh, this came out on Saturday. This video will go up on Monday. They went ahead and dropped Ultimate Legends this weekend, and what a way to start. They ended up dropping Michael Vick, and yeah, Jason Taylor's cool, whatever, but they ended up dropping the 99 overall Michael Vick. And I think to co complete this set, it gets you the Ultimate Legend, but then how do you get the boss one? Is the boss one can only be pulled and or bought? I mean, if someone gets it and then puts it on the auction block, I think that's the only way to get the boss one, correct? Y'all let me know. I think you have to pull it in packs, or if someone gets in the pack, puts it in the auction block, you can buy it that way. But for the Vic, you need three Ultimate Legend badges, so I think these are going to start going up in price. Um, two collectibles, and then three of his players. So let's just see what some of these are going for. And I really hope this records. I've been trying to record this all day. Um, it's Saturday night at 11. I mean, it's what is, what is today? It's Saturday night at 11 o'clock. My internet has been out for a solid 13 hours straight. It finally came back on. It's been weak connecting. I tried to do this in the morning. I couldn't even hold a connection to open packs, and it's just been shoddy. So I gave it all day, and now we're back. So hopefully this records, and I'm able to get it done. Um, so the 81 overall Vic is going for 250K. The 72 overall Vic is going for 300K. Man, so this is pretty much, I can see a lot of people filling this out. I feel like it's easier to get coins this year because of just all the gauntlets and things that are coming out. Um, these pieces aren't, the, okay, there it is. Okay, there it is. Because, I mean, if, you, if you're sitting on like 5 mil and you spend 250, 300, another 250, I mean, that's nothing to you. That is nothing to you to fill out Vic. But that collectible right there almost going for a milli, that one going for 700. What are Ultimate Legend badge, badges going for? They're going for 35k. So that Vic is going for a pretty penny. Um, I think Mudhead this morning had him at 3 mil. And you see my internet's all shoddy as shit. I can't even back out of there. Um, I think the regular Ultimate Legend one was going for 3 mil. And then the boss... Um, oh, there it goes. You piece of shit. And then the boss... Um, Vic was going for like 3.5, 3.2. We're going to try to go right back in and connect. I went ahead and just put the points on here from the PayPal. That's all thanks to you guys. I still I still have another $50 on the PayPal, so we'll see how it goes. I think for the bundle, you only need um, 7,500 points. So, but yeah, here it is. Complete Ultimate Legend sets to unlock new solo challenges. They put up new solos or it's just... Did they put up new solos? Oh, or they put up new solos so that you have to... Uh, do that to get the player like they kind of do with legend players now my shit's just totally frozen i can't even click anything oh there it goes weekly journey style legends so i guess once you fill it all out it'll unlock this yeah okay i got you i got you and then the ultimate taylor so let's peek the auction block and see what these two go for and then we'll go ahead and get on into it if my internet can hold it's really it's really shitty right now um, but if we went ahead and got the 12,000 points, it was $100. I'd have a 50 left over. I don't know if I'll use that 50 for something in real life to buy off PayPal. Maybe use it for when they drop more Ultimate Legends. Maybe save it for golden tickets and rip like a 60 Pro Pack bundle. Oh, uh, we'll see. What am I doing here? Okay. Let's see. Uh, Ultimate Legends. Ultimate Legends. Come on, Auction Block. Work with me here. Work with me here. You don't even got to be... I just need you for two seconds. I just need you for two seconds. Oh, it's going to disconnect. I can already tell. This is a piece of shit. I don't know what Comcast is doing, and I vouch for Comcast. Xfinity is that shit, but... Man. If this takes up any longer, I'll just um end up editing this out. There it goes. Quality, 95 to 99. So, wow, Taylor's pretty damn cheap. Left end? Didn't I just get a left end? I think I'm going to sell that Ziggy Yonza. He hasn't done anything for me. Of course, I don't have a real left end. What is his block? Oh, man. I've been looking for a semi-fast left end. That's actually a left end and not a linebacker because Von Miller, I want to replace that Von Miller. The fact that he has at least 87 block shed. And he's how much? Only 600k. I mean, I wouldn't spend it all on him now, but that's not a bad price. 
That really is not a bad price. And Vic right here. Oh, where's the um ultimate? Okay, so this is this is Big Dick Taylor right here. What's he got on him? What's the difference? He was 90 speed, plus two speed, plus three block shed, finesse. Ooh, that's that's a nice card. That card art looks pretty sick too. So this is the regular Vic here that everyone can complete in a set. It's comparing to McNabb, who we just got. 97 speed. That's absolutely ridiculous. 99 throw power. His medium is kind of questionable at that low 90, but I think, and then they said Vic is now the fastest card in the game. The boss Vic, yeah. He is now the fastest card in the game at 98 speed. Or is it him and DRC? Or, the, or he's the fastest on offense? I don't know. Either way, yeah, that's a lot better. 100 throw power. That could, uh, uh, uh. All right, we're rambling for no reason. This has been six minutes long already. Let's go ahead and do the thing. Maybe we get lucky. Maybe we get lucky here. You never know. Why, why not us? I mean, I've never ever pulled. No, that's a lie. That's a lie. That is a lie. I'll take that back. In Madden 25, I was doing a live stream giveaway. I was giving away my team, and I was opening a bundle on stream. And anything I pulled, I was going to give away. I ended up pulling the ultimate legend, Jerry Rice, the morning he came out on stream in front of people. I had a GS raid, too, and it was crazy. I played two games with him, and then I gave him away on stream. That was absolutely crazy. Um, but besides that, my pack luck has been pretty bad. I had okay pack luck during Madden 25, but since then, my pack luck has been pretty bad. So, in the what do legend packs contain? You get a guaranteed, pl uh, contains a guaranteed legends player collectible. So, pretty much, it's going to be a collectible. At least five gold or elite players and a mix of four other team items. So, this bundle gives you 10 and a topper with a chance, including a topper guaranteed legend. With a chance at an ultimate legend. So we've got 4,500 points left. What do we want to do with that? Oh, we can get the six bundle. Let's do that. Let's just have an ult let's just have an ultimate legend pack frenzy. We could do that or we could get the what's a 60 pack bundle? We could do that or we could get oh I couldn't even get 60, but I could get two fifteens, put us at 30. I just like to do things that increase my chances. I think pro packs give you better. I just think they're better, but did it go through? I don't know. It's being real shitty. I'm going to give it a second. I don't want to click anything. There it goes. Okay. Let's just say a quick prayer. I don't ever ask for much. And if you guys want to know how I got back up to 700K, I never got that Derek Brooks. And then I went ahead and sold a... Um, I completed the... I tell you guys, do this all the time. Complete this little thing over here. The objectives for the week, complete that thing. In the pro pack that they gave me, I pulled a flipping elite that goes for damn 38k. That was absolutely amazing. Here we go. We got 18 unopened packs. Man, it's a real struggle right now. It's really lagging. But yeah, that's how we got our coins back up. I sold one of those. Um, and I got a couple more elite players. So we're going to save the toppers for sure. Ultimate Legend Badge Topper, Ultimate Legend Player Topper. Let's do the Badge Topper first. Let's just get that out the way. Is it just going to be regular Legend Badges or it's going to be the Ultimate Legend Badges? Ooh. Vince Wilfork, huh? So if worse comes to worse, I'm not going to fill out the sets. I'm not going to spend 300 k for a Vic piece, another 250 So we'll definitely sell this. So that's a 40 k come up right there. I think Legend Badges are going to be more expensive now because people are trying to convert them into these to fill out these sets and yada, yada, yada. Um, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. All right, let's go ahead and do it. We got 16 we got 16 legend packs. Let's do it. First one, let's just Oh my god. I Ooh, Reggie Wayne. Let's just get it up out of our system. We just went ahead and revealed it all. You know, we we pulled the trigger real fast. We just started spraying bullets. Um nothing too crazy. If anything, I'm just going to put these golds in the um the gold player badge upgraded thing and then we'll fill out some large quick sells with that. Unless we get any 74 overall golds, the, some of those still go for a pretty penny. Nothing so far. Oh, yeah, you're. I kept thinking, I'm like, damn, I'm really pulling these elites. I think you're guaranteed a uh, legend collectible in each pool. Ooh, 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 ooh. What up, Teddy Ginn? How fast is this man? He's 96 speed. Yo, I'll take a one speed hit. What's your acceleration? Oh, my God, his release and route running is total cheeks, though. Hey, uh, you, you can be... Hey, I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that. Q 
Keep going on through. Keep going on through. Deacon Jones. Armstead. Thing is, I'm doing this at night. I bet you these collectibles have plummeted. I got to get these shits up as soon as I'm done. So that'll be project number one. Get all these collectibles up as soon as I get off. And convert all these legend badges into ultimate legend badges and sell them. Quick, fast, and in a hurry. Keep going through. Did we get our collectible already? Did we get a collectible there? Oh, we did. We got the badge. All right. Let's keep going through. We'll go backwards this time. See what we can get popping here. Leather Legend Badge. You can sprinkle me with an Elite. You don't have to, uh... You don't have to be so stingy with it. What are we at? Ten left? At least we're getting some contracts, too. We got eleven left. Alright. I'm really hoping that... What if Vic was in that topper? I would... Mmm. 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 I don't know what I would do. Probably RKO my Xbox or rock bottom it or something. Alright. Now we're at ten. I'll go ahead and hit a quick reveal all. Heinz Ward collectible, bunch of gold, gold, gold. Got a Fletcher Cox. I mean, he's a base elite, but it is an elite. It's a base elite, but it is an elite. So we got two red things in that one. Mike Polak, Polak, Polak. Sean Taylor collectible. Yeah, these collectibles would be nice if everybody and their mother wasn't getting them too. I don't even want to know how cheap these are going for, but I mean, if they sell for 10k a pop, I'm not mad at it. Lamar Woodley. Jeremy Mincy. Let's go backwards here. Tremaine Brock. Clinton McDonald. Kenny Britt. Joyk Bell. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. I'm in a reveal all mood. I didn't see. Ooh, okay. Y'all going to keep sprinkling me with some these high quality elites? He's 93 speed. He's got 90 tackle. Huh. I mean, I'm not giving up on my man Quinn, but that's a nice looking card. So we've pulled that Ted Ginn and that, uh, okay. All right. Yo, Marshall Falk is a glitch. Anytime I play that man, he does not go down. And he's got like deceptionally fast speed. What is he like? 94, 93 speed. It's kind of hacks. What do we got left? Five left. We're going to reveal all here and reveal all with number two. I think Reveal All has been our best bet. Zach Thomas, collectible. Okay. Next. So this is... Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go with the bullshit. They couldn't let me finish three more packs and wrap this video up. If this doesn't clear out in the next 15 or 10 seconds, we'll go ahead and... Uh... Oh, there it goes. There it goes. And it probably cheated me out of my pack, too. I don't know if we if we get that pack back or it's not even loading. Damn it, you were doing so good, EA. You were doing so good. I got three packs left, man. Let me connect, open these up, and get these kids to bed. Come on now. Thank you. Should have four packs left, you cheeky fucks. Oh, no, we should have five packs left. Oh, I don't even know what we got in that pack. Damn, I'm going to have to go through and see what that... It opened, but it didn't show us what we got. Legend badge. Since we got cheated out of that one, I won't. I'm not going to reveal all the next one. Another Darren Stewart. Okay, maybe he's not that rare to be pulled. All right, we've got two of these packs left. Give me something good. We haven't pulled a single Vic. Or, I mean, I don't expect the Vic and Jason Taylor collectibles to just be spilling out like candy. But I wouldn't be mad if we got one. All right. Last pack, and then we have the topper that's guaranteed a legend player. Could be, could be, could be Vic, could be Taylor. I mean, I don't think it will be, but it could be. All right, let's go and try to see um, what was in that pack. It would have been three, it would have been four elite things back. So if we go quality elite. And if I go newest, it would have been like four or five back. Ah, we got a badge and a Lodi Nada. Okay. So in this in this bundle already, we pulled... I mean, the collectibles are guaranteed, so... So is the topper. So what did we get? Out of 16, we got one, two, three, four, five elite players. Um, Give or take some elite collectibles and the ultimate legend badge. All right, all we have is the topper. 
pretty let me make sure I've got the directions right. It's guaranteed a old it's guaranteed a legend player. And um what is and then an ultimate legend badge? What does it guarantee me? I just want to know so I don't get my hopes up for something. Bundle topper that gives one legend player, including a chance at the ultimate legends this weekend. So it's just one card, no badges, no nothing. That's shitty. Oh my god, did you see that say zero? They tried to do me. Let me open this and get out of here. Alright, here we go. Drum roll in three, two. Ooh, we get a legend Ronde Barber. Huh. That's interesting because I was looking at him like a month back. Deciding between the only reason I didn't get him was because he was 5'10. Um but you want to talk about a free corner like number three or four? If I ever go back to like running dime or quarters or anything? Huh. Hmm. That's not a bad look. Let me see what his price goes for. Let me see what his price goes for. I mean, I don't think the team is doing bad in the secondary already. I mean, if you throw it up and hold Y, I mean, it doesn't really matter who I have. That's not bad, so let's just see what his price goes for. I also want to see what the legend badges go for. So Ronde goes for 175. Could probably sell him at like 180 during the day. Um I want to see what these legend badges go for. Would it be would I get more out of selling these one by one? Or would I get more out of selling the ultimate legend badges? So these go for 20k a pop. Um and it takes three of them to make the it takes three of them to make the ultimate legend ones, which are going for a whopping. I think I only have one of those actually, and these are going for a whopping 37k. So I think it makes more sense to sell them one by one and go from there. So I appreciate it, guys. We might have a million worth of coins here. Um, a million. It'll put us over a million, depending on what like what the Ted Ginn goes for. Oh my God, he is dirt cheap. Ew, that's disgusting. That's depressing. Okay, I take my statement back. We might not have. I mean, who knows? And I just wanted to see what this man goes for. I got him twice, so I don't think he's going for more than 20K. Sick. That's what I thought. All right, guys, I appreciate it. Let me know if you were lucky enough to pull any of the Vic collectibles, any of the Taylor collectibles. This video ended up spilling over like 15 minutes long. Um, and let me know what you think of the Vic. I made it my vow. I would eventually get a Vic one day in Madden. I don't know if it's going to be this Madden, even though that one seems obtainable, but... We're going to get a Michael Vick one day, but I appreciate it, guys. All the links are in the description. This will be Monday's video. Let me know what you think. Again, thank you for the 3,000 subscribers. This is the 3,000 subscriber. Thank you, tribute, whatever you want to call it. Um, And as always, guys, like, share, favorite, sub, deuces.